Pusha T, how you feel about him cutting ties with Kanye West? The thing is this, right? Family is a word that gets thrown around a lot loosely. You know what I mean? And I could actually say that Kanye is my family, right? We not blood relatives, but that's my family. You know, we, 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 I've done, we've done more things. We have more interactions mutually than we have with our own family, right? Um, so when I see something like that, um, I'm conflicted. I'm, 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 I'm disgusted, you know, because for a multitude of reasons and, and they're not all directed at Pusha T, you know, like I have to be, if I'm going to be me, I have to be honest. Like they're not like emotional. They're not really even emotional. They're more like good music is like I said. We go back if we go back in the interview, right? This is something that like literally I helped build with my bare hands. You know, it wasn't nothing. Like whether you whatever the narrative was at Rockefeller, this, that, and the third, right? At the end of the day, it was a lot of it was on my back, you know. Kanye um, eventually propelled to stardom, so whatever we did worked. Um, but he and I both know that, you know, whenever there's anything, you know, like I, my equity is in is in his career, you know what I'm saying, and in the label. So that's where I'm disgusted, right? With somebody. Um, who wasn't there from the start, you know, and was they situation was compromised, comes along, and then when Ye is in a situation that he talked himself into, he got to be responsible for that, obviously, 100%. But so we not going to stick together? We not going to stick together? I don't, you, I don't. Whether I agree with Kanye or not, it's not the principle of that. Like I said, I told you all this street shit, right? Pusha T done told you all this street shit, right? All this street shit. And now we doing this industry shit? Nah. 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 You know what I mean? We, you know. Now... And fairness, right? Does Pusha T have a right to distance himself from situations that he don't want to be in? Yeah, he a man. You know what I'm saying? Do those two have grievances behind the scenes that that are not being spoke about? Yes, they do. You know what I'm saying? And so part of this shit is kind of cap. Because my thing is don't you going the whole good music president shit that's cap that's cap boy no good music president shit nigga like that shit is cap and ain't been that shit for years you know what i'm saying so if a nigga kick us some resignation shit ain't no resignation shit just say you mad about the Don the three party in chicago when he ain't let you on stage say that you know what i mean but so you basically dead in good music, like yo, I'm I'm I got my I'm going for the Grammy and 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 fuck the block. So I'm I'm a, I, I, what what you want me to do? Say all right, yeah, keep keep going, like nigga, ain't nothing pussy about me, nigga, at all. You dig? And ain't none of this personal. You everybody got the right to do whatever they want to do. So and that includes me. So I got the right to be like, you know what? Nah. Niggas ain't gonna just dead the block like that. Nah, just so you could eat. You Pharrell, man. That's why you running around with Pharrell right now. You know what I'm saying? And that's cool. All that shit is cool. You know what I'm saying? But my man, 
He in a crisis and niggas is out. I said it once, I'll say it again. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? I ain't the only nigga that got to check with Ye. You know what I'm saying? I'm the only nigga who says something, no. I'm definitely the only nigga who says something. So you know what I mean? You want me to respect that shit? Like, nigga, I don't, come on, bro. Like, yo, you know what I mean? And, and honestly, listen, they may, they may, they may um, communicate and find resolve to that situation, but as it stands, I don't, I don't fuck with that. Because cause I expect more out of Pusha T, honestly. You know what I'm saying? Like, this nigga based everything he, he stand for on the streets. You know what I'm saying? So, I ain't saying you got to support it or not. Like, if you win the, if Pusha T win the Grammy, he, Ye did have the album. So, what, you not going to thank him? Or you gonna thank them and act like you ain't say you resigned and you didn't, do, you know what I mean? So it's just like, this is like a lot of games, and I'm not really with none of that shit, to be honest with you. You know what I mean? Like, that's my take on it. Ain't none of this shit personal. That's me speaking as a man. I'm not in the same space where, you know, um, many moons ago, I went at niggas because I ain't like how shit was going down. I'm not in that space. I'm a grown man. And I'm not going to play no games with nobody. I'm not speaking to niggas one minute and then acting like I don't fuck with them the next. Like, I'm not with that. You know what I'm saying? Like, at the end of the day, like, it was all good when niggas was doing a puff dance in the Diet Coke video. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to stay like that, bro. Like, or you don't. You know what I mean? But the Pusha T Drake problem is, or the good music Drake problem is, is directly correlated with Pusha and his situation with Wayne. Like, prior to that, I, I never had no problem with Drake. You know what I'm saying? Like, Drake, I've, I've never put it to you like this. I've been to Drake house. I know, I've never been to Pusha T crib. I've been, I came to Drake house and he rolled out the red carpet for me. And Kanye. Or Kanye and me. Whatever you want, however you want word. We went over there when they were supposed to do the joint album. And Drake, yo, whatever y'all want, yo, order. Mama had a chef cook for you. Boom, boom, boom. Ah, ah, ah. Yo, playing M40 in them, playing 100 beats. Yo, y'all, you know, me and 40 speaking. Yo, come up to Canada. Come, we, we love you, nigga. Da, 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 da. Like, that all got flushed down the toilet for over envy and, and niggas needing. You know, feeling like, you know, whatever they ended up doing with nigga telling niggas about a son and subbing a nigga and all this other shit. I'm like, I ain't got nothing to do with no shit like that, kid. And that's a fact. You know what I'm saying? If I ever went at a nigga, I went at a nigga. When, when, I, when, I, when, when I got pulled into the Drake situation, it was, it was due to the fact that it was supposed to be family. Like, niggas put, I'm not putting my neck on no fucking chopping block ever again for niggas that's going to fucking run. Know what I mean? I'm not with none of that shit. 